Zamba show up to, um, uh, gosh, what was it? Set the pace a couple weeks back. And I'm like, oh, my man is comfy enough to win this. My, my favorite anecdote that I have, um, I, I, for those of you that don't know, I worked on a documentary on Apollo Kage for a while. Um, and we interviewed Witness, who was his sponsor for a while. Uh, and the story, as he tells it, is their first time meeting. Um, he was asking around for the best Smash player, and they were told, oh yeah, AK, he's the best player in the region. Um, and he was like, well, how do I find him? And they said, yeah, look for the Smash player in, in pajama pants. It took him five tries to find AK. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you know what? No pajama time here though. We are going in an all-out brawl. Con Con not going to Min Min, instead going Bayo. What a what a busted roster. Min Min and Bayo. Yeah. Con Con's got a really good lineup. The Bayo and Min Min is just it, it's this really good vicious dual combo. You know? On one side, you've got one of the best boxers in the game, just able to create a giant rectangle on either side of herself uh, and just play that space. Now on the other side, you have one of the best combo characters in the game. Not Smash 4 levels, thank God, but still a pretty deadly combo when brought together. God, you're gonna tell me that they're gonna pick up Steve next and then we'll really have Blizzy McGuire in Jersey. Well, I'll wait till we get to the other side of Winners. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, Delta Force doing a pretty good job in a matchup that's often considered not very good for Link. Uh, let's be fair, that's most matchups for Link. Shh, shh. Look, listen, I gotta give some Link names their hope. Look, I, I would love if this character was much better, but Delta Force is one of the better practicers of this character. Um, New Jersey PR, I don't have the exact number off the top of my head, but I know just recently made one of the top 10 in New Jersey PR and absolutely makes this character look like, you know, there is top tier potential sitting somewhere, somewhere deep in there. I think there is because look at that up tilt. Outside of Bowser, oh my God, and here come those smash attacks I was promised earlier. Kong Kong just coming out with invincibility and being like, hold this fist. Yeah, Kong Kong, a, again, a really good pilot in Bayonetta. There's a couple good Bayos in New Jersey, um, but Kong Kong is one of them that just rocks in and out, gets those percent combos just like that, 38% right off the bat. And it's just really good at getting those consistent hits in as needed. And right now, it looks like, ooh, actually caught on the boomerang there. Yeah, you always have to be cognizant of where that is. Delta Force is not gonna throw that out immediately in front of himself and just kind of set this up like the, yep, the Belmont Cross. Great okay, good patience. news, I found it. Delta Force yes. is 10th on the New Jersey PR. That's what oh, I was looking for. Oh no. So every match is very important for him because he's on yes. the cusp of losing it. You're a Link main and you got a, your PR. Everyone's going to take you and be like, yeah, I got a PR win, guys. Look at me. He's going to be like, ah, yeah, congrats. Yeah, congrats. You beat, you beat the low tier main in, in the PR, but Con -con. Con -con. come on, mid high, mid high. Mid high, okay, mid high might be reaching. Regardless, Con Con, no stranger to the PR either, has been PR'd in the past. I don't believe is on the current PR. I could be lying. Okay, I'm so he's a bit of a chip on his shoulder against Delta yeah. Force. Not being like, you're on PR. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Old PR. Okay, thank you. Thank you, production. I'm from New England. <laughs> I'm from California. Hey, there you go. I mean, like, I live in New York, live. but, you know, yeah. originally good old Cali. Yeah, no, I, I'm currently in Savannah, Georgia, so <laughs> that gives oh. you an idea of how not in New Jersey I am, but Con Con I... has a pretty decent lead at the moment. Has 124, another good hit from Delta will take it here, but I mean, hit by hit, you know, it's extra percent and you're never gonna be mad about getting extra percent on a stock like this. Yeah, you kind of just need it because then, hey, you can just, you can run away with it. If you can take this stock, not gonna die off the top just yet. Great hero spin back on stage though, 150, okay. But this is still where Con Con can make his money. 85% isn't high enough that uh, these combos are going to stop working. Yeah, this is where we kind of need to see that um, hidden top tier potential that you sometimes find Link players talking about. There's always been such optimization around the bomb. If you can get a good uh -oh. combo, you might be able to do something. But <gasps> the Warrior might have other things to say. Oh, oh he inputs. couldn't throw it down in time. Yeah, he was trying to go for it. I think a boomerang came out instead was trying to drop with, I think it was supposed to be Z drop bomb, but there's a specific timing to it. And yeah, I don't think Delta Force got it right there. And it came out as a boomerang. Yeah, but Con, just... Con all smiles. 
He's like, yeah, I'm good. Yeah, you this take the fine. win. You get a win and you take it. No, no reason to be complaining about that. Oh, I see exactly what happened there. Delta yeah. Force actually believed he was just dead, so he just didn't react. This is why you don't give up until you see game. And now we're on game two. Going back to PS2. Yeah, a lot of players in Jersey like this stage. Let's be real. Okay, they, uh... people in New York, people in Connecticut, people in Pennsylvania. It let's, was let's so... be real. United States has has something, something for PS2, and we gotta we gotta be fixing this. No, there are never. other stages. It's got good Pokemon music. Okay, but imagine having good Pokemon music and the entire rest of the soundtrack. That's Whoa, what small, small battlefield is. Yeah, oh. small battlefield. <laughs> Small Battlefield is the better PS2, and I will die on this hill. Agreed. But you know what? The people aren't ready for the truth. Just like that, they are not ready for Link to be top tier. Yeah, this is right. the thing about Delta. I was kind of getting into it a little bit, um, but a lot of people talk about the bomb as being sort of the height of Link's potential, you know, ceiling. You know, if you can get these crazy Z-drop combos, oh, you might be able God. to do some top tier stuff. But also a good forward smash just like that will kind of negate any amount of top tier privilege you might be able to pull out of one item. Well, here's the thing. He he spot dodged that. And the forward smash actually just extended because it hit the bomb. Yeah, good awareness there from Con Con. Hitbox extensions are another thing that I feel like more players... Everyone talks about items as like, you know, you need to know how to play around items if you want to play smash at the top level. I think hitbox extensions are another thing you need to be aware of how to play around because there are a lot of characters. It's effectively the entire items cast, as well as like Steve and Nana and Popo as well. A couple others to just have these extra hitboxes that you can attack. And in attacking those, you can extend your hitboxes and awareness of that will get you into a higher echelon of this game. Folks, if you're as confused as me at home, just remember, the more you play this game, the more you talk about it, the more you realize the rabbit hole just keeps getting deeper. To those who are being bewildered by my words, uh, play game more, get good. Mm, you know what? A little confused. It didn't go to my local. Still trash. <laughs> but you know what? Both players just kind of fighting for their lives. Maybe ComCon just a little bit more. Even a 175 Delta Force. Even with a sword that is better than, I would say, the other links. Still can't secure a kill. But there's that bomb. Finally getting it. Oh, Con Con trying to get another forward smash. Yeah, this is a bit of a struggle that I feel like Link kind of falls into. You have a lot of these strong kill options, um, but there's definitely a Marthritis to it. You know, you have you have good kill options, but you don't have good combos. You can't get into them once you start, especially getting past, you know, like about where Link is right now, actually, 116. Um, generally, if your opponent is around that percent, you're not going to be able to combo into things with like Boomerang, for example, or Back Air. You might be able to get a drag down from here and there, but it's not going to be the same combo potential that, you know, you had in Smash 4 Link, for instance. Yeah, instead you're just kind of go for these stray hits, just like Bayo has to do right there at this percent. It's a straight back, Back Air, maybe some guns, or just an up tilt into a Back Air, but something to secure this kill. Yeah, I don't think... We're at 340, but these sets have potential to go pretty long because both these characters can struggle to kill. If we go to a game three in this winter side, there might be potential for a timeout there, but I don't think it's going to be happening this game, especially not with Delta Force currently sitting at nearly 180. You know, the higher the percent gets, the more kill options just pop up. Yeah, but this is a great percent for Delta Force. It's very even right now. At 176, Bayo just can't kill. Oh my gosh, to drag down forward air. What's he gonna do? Still the boomerang to cover the lower parts. Finally gets that up tilt. Did, oh, oh my god, oh my god, I thought he killed himself. Was that the auto timer? <laughs> that was the auto timer. Man, as a snake main, I can relate to that on so many levels. I've I've put myself in that exact situation. Yeah, you never you never like to see it. You're going over to pick up your bomb or reset it, and it just gets blown up in your face. But forward throw there, I think, was the wrong option um i think back throw would kill i know bayo's got a couple kill throws but a back air if nothing else will absolutely secure that at 200 percent so delta force now does have a little bit of a lead. a four throw will kill but only at ledge it's a bit of like a jab situation that's within coming in clutch to get out of the arrow spin and now this is a good percent for both players we're gonna start seeing those combos one after another 
perfect patience to get that grab back here, but a good SDI to get out. 77%. This is kill range for this is kill range for Delta Force. Yeah, if Delta Force can get a good couple hits in here, get a bomb down. We'll be cooking for free, absolutely, but needs to get a couple things right. 70% building right back up though. Those percents are getting even, and now we're kind of getting back into similar terrain to where we were in uh the last stock. Not fully gonna be dealing with, you know neither player being able to kill but it's an even stock and anyone will be getting close to kill percent pretty soon yeah both players scrambling harder than my eggs this morning four throw bomb bomb catches z drop oh and finally caught him in the air great stuff from delta force evening this set up one one yeah delta force you can see why seed three and seeded on the current pr really good player makes this Again, in my opinion, mid-tier character look like one of the best. Doesn't even play it like one of the best. I, I feel like every time I've tried to bring it up, I've gotten cut off. But Delta Force isn't one who plays around the kind of Z-drop bomb combos that you see people talk about all the time. Rather, just uses it as this really good tool for space denial. That's what Delta Force is really good at, is taking a space and controlling it until you can't play it. Well, that's kind of the difference between, I'd say, a link that is kind of like a mid-level, like intermediate, being like, oh, I just learned these, let me try and use it at every single opportunity. And then those who are like, it's a tool, but I'm not going to over-rely on it. Well, let's see if we can see more of that great item play here in Game 3, Small Battlefield, your favorite stage. I was telling you, yeah. Uh, this is the counter pick for ConCon, Con, and I kind of get it. Uh, giving less space for the link to play around in is not a bad idea whatsoever. You know, you're closing up these blast zones as well a little bit. Uh, the side blast zones are a little bit further from the edges, but at the end of the day, this is probably something that's going to work out a little bit better for the band. You know what else worked out? Mr. Patch. Indeed. <laughs> hey, I go. think you, you guys may have heard I was uh, on my way <laughs> from a work event that went a little longer than expected. Wow. Um, All right, so how many drinks are you to in? Be here. <laughs> I know work events. It's an excuse to say hi to your co-workers and maybe drink a little. And then get some dirt on them for the eventual HR complaints. <laughs> I didn't even get to do all that. That's nice fun. Lame. I don't think I work in the same places as you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, law firms go crazy. <laughs> that makes sense, actually. That makes so much more sense now that you say that. Well, jeez, what's Anyways. going on, guys? I, I what's hate what's to going on? Interrupt. Look at this. No one, no one has killed each other. Yeah, I was about to huh? what's going on is we've got two characters who struggle to kill, and so we are once again in this fantastic deadlock situation where they're throwing out kill moves, but they have no confirms into them, so they kind of just throw out more kill moves. Oh, you oh know, but it's that's a good a kill move. To Which time? Still not killing, though. Oh, oh, great air dodge, though. Trying to get the little cheeky hero spin reversal, but Kong not going to fall for it. Still yeah, throwing out moves, that. though. A little bit heavier than you expect him to be. I okay, sure. A little bit staled on the forward throw there. That makes sense. And yeah, that fast fall speed to mix things up. Very unique property where Link speeds up faster than any other character on that fast fall, and that's one of the instances where it kind of matters. Now trying to get a little shimmy. Doesn't do it. And still, we are at four minutes and forty seconds. Still, neither player has killed one another. You were talking about that opportunity for going on time. We may see this go down to the wire. Yeah, four and a half. Still on three stocks. <laughs> Chat at this point started to get restless. And there we go. Finally, a trade to send Delta Force down first. Con Con, probably not going to be too far behind as I'm finishing my sentence. Okay. You know what? I think both players are playing a little more confidently, a little more aggressively now that they're at, uh, you know, low percents. They're not trying to recreate that first stock, the second one. Okay. We're getting into things a little bit more. But once again, like, the percents have been even and they haven't really gotten too far apart at this point. Or at least not when it's mattered. This is probably the furthest we've seen it in, like, a game and a half. But, ooh, Delta Force trying to get it a little bit closer. Con Con just playing good evasive right now. Delta Force just trying to get back on the ground safely. Con Con still keeping up this pressure. Even if they don't kill right now, at least they're racking on this damage. Throws away the bomb, doesn't need it. Yeah, once again, it's hit by hit the back air there. Gonna swing a little wide, not quite gonna take it. Delta Force 
Sitting in a better position, but which time can change everything. Air Great air oh. dodge and the forward smash. That's a really good reversal from Delta Force right there. Yeah, which time did change everything, but not the way we thought. Not at all. <laughs> that was actually very smart to get the air dodge out during the witch time. Just extend your iframes as well. No, the man like. Oh, and there it is God. again. Yeah, both players are speeding up their play. Those first stocks, for example, took two and a half minutes. Uh, that second stock took uh, 90 seconds for the first one, two minutes for the second. It's it's an unspoken rule that you don't want to lose viewer, viewers during during top eights. Yeah, you got to get the hype going. And both these players trying to get a little further into this top eight here. Great use of boomerang to break up the upbeat combos. But here it comes back again. Which times are just not finding their purchase right now, though? No, but you're starting to see what Konkan is going for. He's actually trying to stale it out, so Delta Force is actually having to burn that air dodge, so he's actually caught into a frame trap later on. Unless the forward oh my smash comes God. Oh, wow. Nice little pop off there, too. Delta Force really clean with those forward smashes this game. That hey, he learned to be from the, the best, maker. Con Con. It absolutely was. Link forward smash does kill at a reasonable percent. And it does have kind of that level of, I screwed up, where you can send out the first swing. And if you know you're going to die as a result, you can hold back. You can not hit the second one. Yeah, so Mr. Patch, this is uh, exactly what you missed out on that first game. Oh. Bit of a flub. He didn't believe he was uh, alive there. Yeah, close call with the uh, bomb self hit attempt looked like Ooh, okay oh, that item extension was crazy i was gonna say two can f smash in this set oh yeah Listen. con con was definitely throwing out the f smashes let's not get that <laughs> twist <laughs> it's his favorite move it's a good move wait was that a intentional bomb self hit to like get launched up into the blast zone for for the no. jungle <laughs> no that was a uh, if You're it was too much crazy, credit now but that was the timer <laughs> cracked that was that. the timer going off can you imagine though let him cook <laughs> okay so that game three with the slow start uh seemed rather exceptional <laughs> wasn't seeing a lot of that uh from these clips of, of the other two games. No, they're yeah, trying to slow it down. that was definitely the most con-con time out of the three as well. So Weimer, you were talking about how you're a snake main. Yes. Uh, number one, congratulations. Hurt did very well this weekend. Number and two, we are you- And we love more for it. Yes. Are you excited to see an influx of uh, week one snake mains? The amount, every time, you know, somebody does something, another snake main appears. It, they just keep coming out of nowhere. Like, I, I, I keep I seeing them. I that myself. I keep I seeing them again them and again. Three weeks ago. No, I, I will grant, I mentioned it before, I worked on an Apollo Kage documentary. So I am like one of the top progenitors of snake propaganda. Ooh. <laughs> so I can't, I, you know, I can't complain at all about the amount of snake mains. I'm helping us get a little further in the world. So it doesn't hurt you, you might say. Nope. Oh. Ha, ha, ha. Shout out to Okay. Her. Hey, Mama. I'm here too. <laughs> My sweat is going to transition. You, you got shouldered out. <laughs> Wait, That's all right. Understandable. They've seen enough of my face. They're sick of it at this point. <laughs> Besides, I got to see the Banjo-Kazooie sweatshirt. Look at that. Look at your merch. Look at your wall. Hey, you are decorated. Got to gotta, gotta have the backdrop. All the, all the gamer-related convention stuff <laughs> i got somewhere to put it all uh i gotta be honest with you th though this is just like i just kind of like got my dress shirt off got a hoodie on like <laughs> i'm in a tank top and a hoodie this is what i was wearing around today